Hey, today I want to tell you about the best service in the best VPN category. I researched about 15 VPNs and based on the data I collected and my thoughts, I found the best one that suits me perfectly. In this short video, I will show you a few secrets that few people know about that make it truly one of the best in the best VPN category. Let's not waste time and get started. Winscribe apps have one of the simplest and cleanest interfaces among VPN apps, which however does not prevent this service from coping with almost all the tasks that you can set for a VPN. The Winscribe team is justifiably proud to give its users multiple ways to connect to the web. This company has at its disposal a server network of approximately 534 servers in 100 cities in 52 countries. And that, I must say, is a source of pride for Winscribe, as some VPN services using fake WHOIS IP data. Winscribe will gladly offer its customers to connect to real servers located in those countries. The company pays special attention to the protection of user data. The desktop app uses AES-256 encryption and 4096-bit RSA keys, while the browser extension uses TLS 1.2, ECDHE RSA, P256 key exchange and AES-128 GCM security cipher. Forward secrecy is also supported in desktop applications. Winscribe is also making efforts to bypass government censorship. The Stealth Connection protocol was created specifically for this purpose. However, if users still experience problems, the service specialist will help you manually configure the IP using the propriety IPI resolution tool. Winscribe states that it maintains logs of all internet activity and traffic. It should be taken into account that all session data is deleted within three minutes after disconnection. Winscribe offers its users a variety of connection options. As mentioned earlier, you will find over 530 servers in 50 plus countries here. If you decide to use this service for free, then you will have access to servers in only 11 countries. Most of Winscribe's servers are only available to pro users. With access to multiple servers in North and South America, Europe, Asia and even Africa, users of the service can easily find the server that suits them the best. Since many non-US users only set up a VPN to access Netflix and Hulu, you might be interested to know that this service has many servers in the US. However, our tests of Netflix and BBC iPlayer showed mixed results. Netflix would open every other time when connected to Winscribe, but BBC iPlayer would not open at all. Winscribe lets its users choose the server they want. You can open a full list of servers, which sometimes have funny names. This feature can be extremely useful when you want to bypass geo-based blocking of content of interest. Winscribe has apps for all platforms. You can install them on Windows, Mac or Linux. As an additional layer of protection, the company recommends using the plugins for Google Chrome, Firefox and Opera browsers. Winscribe can also be installed on your smartphone, TV and even router. What's more, you can even install the Winscribe app on any device that supports OpenVPN, IKE version 2 and SOX4 protocol. The user interface itself is a small window that displays the server location, your IP address, firewall status, a giant on-off button and an additional menu where users can change some settings, edit their account details and among other things ask for help. By default, the connection is established to a server in the United States labeled Best Location. However, clicking on the arrows will open a list of all available Winscribe locations, which includes regions in all countries. So the USA is divided into three regions, US Central, US East and US West. And opposite each of them, you will see the corresponding ping value. Selecting preferences from the menu and opening the connection tab, you will see the available connection protocols. If you don't trust automatic settings, you can switch to manual mode and choose IKE version 2, UDP, TCP or Stealth. Here users will be able to specify port numbers in case the ports are blocked by default. 
stealth mode TCP from Stono is wide scripts and censored way of browsing the internet for Chinese residents. If it fails, Winscribe will even let you manually configure the IP using the Resolution API tool. Many of the settings are intended for technical advanced users, while beginners will need to look for more information or contact tech support. However, a VPN isn't the only thing Winscribe has to offer. There are also several browser extensions available to help you protect yourself and your data when you browse the web. Among them are the following, ad blocking, double hop, and time zone spoofing. Winscribe has an online chat where users can reach out to support staff for help in case of any technical issue. Answers to questions come extremely quickly, but there is one caveat. A bot will answer you in the chat, which will simply search for the appropriate keywords. This is just a bot, but it searches well enough. A fact. If the chatbot cannot find the answers to your questions, then the Winescribe technical support staff will come to your aid. When you create a ticket, your request will be forwarded to a technical support employee who will take care of your issue. Winscribe also invites its customers to subscribe to a service thread on reddit.com, where users and employees can discuss the app and, in particular, the issues they are facing. Winscribe VPN has free and paid plans. Users of the free plan will have access to fewer servers and only 10 GB of traffic per month. You can earn extra gigabytes by mining cryptocurrency or by inviting friends. In turn, users of the plant tariff will be able to connect as many devices as they like and not think about traffic at all. It will be unlimited. Winscribe accepts a variety of payment methods. You can even pay with bitcoins if you want to remain as anonymous as possible.